Hey everybody, it's Michael from the Loftus Party. I'm back! I am back in the old stomping grounds, the New York kitchen. I got my uh, paper towel holder. Okay, today, 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 lots to go over. Uh, Kanye. Kanye is the newsmaker and the newsbreaker. Usually it's Kim. Usually uh, Kim Kardashian gets naked and everybody's like, Kim Kardashian broke the internet. Kanye's like, watch this. Boom. Now Kanye, you got to follow him on Twitter. Uh, he, he'll, he'll tweet things uh, just like cavalierly, like, uh, I'd like to meet with Tim Cook. I got some ideas. <laughs> right? And I think he got the meeting. Wouldn't that be nice if we could tweet them? Hey, I want to uh, meet with Tim Cook. Got some ideas. Boom. Okay, so uh, that's the level. Uh, Kanye loves President Trump. Loves Trump. He tweeted out, uh, he tweeted out uh, this. I, I got these written down because I don't want to get them wrong. Uh, you don't have to agree with Trump, but the mob can't make me not love him. We're both dragon energy. He is my brother. I love everyone. I don't agree with everything anyone does. That's what makes us individuals, and we have the right to independent thought. Instantly, the dude lost like nine million thought. That in today's day and age, it is super brave to come out and go, "I love Trump." Kanye, God bless you. Now. The follow-up tweet is what made, what, uh, made me laugh. It's because, like, uh, like, right after Kanye's, like, I love Trump and you can't make me, the mob can't make me not love him. <laughs> so almost instantly he writes, he's like, hey, my wife just called me and she wanted to make this uh, clear to everyone. I don't agree with everything uh, Trump does. I don't agree 100% with anyone but myself. So uh, Kim's out shopping and, and just just probably shits herself. Because Kanye just outed himself as a Trump fan, and she's like, "Baby, you you gotta make sh sure that uh, they know that you just you're not 100. percent You gotta say something." So he walked it back a little bit. Already, already, it's going. The media they're calling him crazy. They're straight up calling Kanye West crazy, mentally unhinged. That's how bad it is. It's tough out there. God love you, Kanye, for doing it. They're gonna call you crazy. Cause here's the look. When when somebody they, they'll ask you this 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 just happened to me, uh, in a meeting. They start putting it together that you didn't vote for Hillary, and so then they start. You can see the wheels turning, and then they, they go, "Wait, did you did you vote for uh, Trump?" And now uh, you honestly say, you know, yeah, I did. Then this look washes over their face. This I had a meeting the other day. <laughs> And she literally like looked out the window as if the strength uh, to deal with someone as stupid as me would would come in and feel like fill her up like you get some like heavenly energy like you could see her almost praying like Lord how do I, I deal with this person who's just this <sighs> stupid and and then everything kind of just changed after that. They really, they really, they, they. If you supported Trump, they look at you like uh, you're, you're crazy, you're deranged, you're a high functioning idiot. So uh, thanks for being patient. I don't have like the followers that uh, uh, Don, that Donald Trump, that Kanye Trump has. That's what I should call him now, Kanye Trump. Yeezy. Uh, so now uh, Kanye's been going at it. God bless him. He's got, uh, he got his uh, Make America Great Again hat signed. And if you ask me, Kanye's probably the only person besides Donald Trump that could actually wear that hat and uh, not get his ass kicked. However, Kanye, they're going to try to kick your ass. Okay, so uh, uh, more Kanye tweets. He, he said this. If your friend jumps off the bridge, you don't have to do the same. Ye being ye, and I want to stop, stop it right there. Kanye West is tweeting the word ye, like old Y-E, like ye old English. That's pretty cool. That's I'm, pr I'm trying to bring back words like twas and hearken, you know, but Kanye is just dropping ye. So he says, uh, if, if a buddy jumps off the bridge, uh, you don't have to do the same. Ye being ye is a fight for you to be you, and that's pretty cool. He says, for people in my life, the idea of Trump is pretty much a 50-50 split, but I don't tell a Hillary supporter not to support Hillary. 
I love Hillary. And that's awesome. Uh, you can be you. We're all about independent thought. We're all about free thinkers. We're all about fresh ideas. And yes, you can support who you want to support. And we're not going to crap all over you. So uh, Kanye, you lost a bunch of Twitter followers. Hopefully you, you got a bunch of new ones. I appreciate your bravery, dude. And uh, right now they're calling you crazy. And uh, Kim Kardashian is coming to his defense. God bless her. Good woman. She's she's tweeting back. She's mad. It is uh, an awesome, awesome display. This is what I love about social media, you guys. Uh, so anyway, next week, I'm, I'm hoping to have some Avengers news. I'm going to watch that. I'm worried about who's going to live, who's going to die. Uh, go to theloftestparty.com for all the updates. Please uh, click uh, like and subscribe and hit the little uh, bell. That way you won't miss nothing. You guys are great. I, I like your new jacket. I hope you like my new jacket. Boom! I don't know what I'm saying. Well, hey, this is Michael Loftus, and let ye be ye.